Hi guys, welcome back to another video. It's Kimberly and here I'm planning the September monthly. I'm using Planning Choco's September kit and here I have my sticker books and my sticker album where I store all my stickers and right now I'm writing out all the dates that are in the month of September. So right now I'm going to put down the September headers and this one includes the block off dates and now I'm going to put on the other side. Writing out the sections, the lines for the notes part of the layout. And since the this printable had an October monthly already included from the block off dates, I decided to just white out the entire thing. So for my monthly layouts, I don't plan an order of day by day or I just plan whenever I remember an event. So for the 15th, I decided to put out a full box and the date number to mark down, it was the Sugary Planner Conference. And then for the 9th, I decided to put down Grandparents Day and a quarter box to mark down that my grandma is coming back from Hong Kong, ironically. So here I'm looking through my sticker album and decided to put down a rose gold foiled airplane sticker that I made. So now I'm marking down the days that I don't have school and I was deciding whether or not to put it on the weekends including but I just decided to put, down, put it down on the days that I don't have school. I also decided to layer some Simply Gilded 5mm um, white washi with rose gold foil on top of the days that I don't have school so it won't be that plain. So for the 18th, I decided to put down the happy birthday label that was included in the kit to mark down my cousin's birthday. And here I'm layering some washi tape. So for the second, I decided to put down a quarter box and a black lab sticker that I made that's in my shop right now to mark down that it was my puppy's six month birthday. And now for the third, I'm marking down that it's my parents' anniversary. So for the third, I decided to put down a quarter box to mark down that Black Panther was going to be on Netflix. And now I'm going to the 23rd and marking down it's the first day of fall. And for the 24th, it was five months till my birthday, so I used a rose gold foiled heart that I made. 
So for the 17th, I used two Vildu labels to mark down that I had YouTube and Simply Gilded subscriptions due. And going to the other side of the spread, I used a quarter box to mark down that it, the movie A Simple Favor was coming out. So I used another bill to sticker to mark down my shop's bill and a geotag for the 15th to mark down the planner conference. And for the 14th, I used a quarter box with an asterisk to mark down a simple favor was coming out. And the 13th was to mark the Scribble Prince Co's mystery kit sign up. And going back to the 24th, it was Dancing with the Stars premiere night, which I love watching. So now I'm going back to the 5th, which was the first day of school. But before that, I have a Monday schedule for classes. So I used a alarm clock sticker to mark down it was a Monday schedule and a house looking sticker to mark down it was the first day of public school and I love tutoring little kids so I had to mark it down. So going to the other side of the spread I cut up a full box to mark down that I had dinner with my fellow volunteers. So I used a piece of glitter washi that I used to mark down the days that I didn't have school to close off the box and now I'm using a meeting sticker and a food sticker from the rose gold sheet to mark down the dinner. And now I'm putting down my headers for the check boxes. So I used to do reminders, movies, and <coughs> events. So for the 7th, I used two quarter boxes to mark down two movies that were coming out on Netflix. So here's the completed spread, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until next time, bye!